All right, guys, this is day two of snapper season. I think as per snapper season regulations, it is rough out. We were hoping to go further out, but uh, pretty pretty choppy. So we're just gonna stop here. It's a good place this is where we were last yesterday evening. And uh, it was a good spot. We got some good fish. And this time we got a good live well full of fresh, lively baits. And uh, I think we're gonna catch some good fish. So we're on the ledge now. It's pretty cool. You can see it on Seymour. I'll, I'll post a picture. So you can see what I'm saying. But uh, I think we're gonna have a good day. I think it's gonna lay down and the snapper should be thick. So we're gonna catch them up, stay tuned. Had a bite. There he goes. Come on. Take the bait. He's biting. Oh, we got him. Uh. Um. Probably not like yours or anything, but. Here he comes. Oh. It is a snapper. First snapper of the day, guys. A little snapper like that ate a big old pogey. About that. And we're using like a eight or nine out circle hook which i know if you ever look at circle hooks from all the different brands they're all all over the place but it's a hook about this big and it's uh nice and thin kind of a, a nice big enough gap maybe even bigger gap than that but it's a general idea of what it looks like our three-way swivel rigs stuff like that The net. I get it. It's coming up. Yeah, it's up here. There you go. That's a good quality fish right there. A little fire drill. We got a lot of people on the boat more than usual, more stuff. And that net's, of course, a magnet for everything. Um, but he's able to get around and get it scooped up, so that's good. They should be here. They seem like they run up and down it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that works good. There you go. Uh-oh, devil. There you go, Dad. Almost there, Mom. There we go. Ready? Yep. Good. Never mind. He... Okay. It's a good one, though. What's that? Yours is pretty good. I see how those schools of fish come through. The snapper will do that. You'll be anchored on the leads like we are. No bites. And all of a sudden, boom, boom. Everyone gets a bite. I think the schools go back and forth. Pull it up off the bottom about three, he's got one on, three or four turns. It just slides, when I pull up, the hook flips, and it slides. We got a cool video on YouTube if you want to see it underwater. Lay him up. There you go, we're getting close, guys. Yeah, we're at mono. Here he comes. Good fish, there we go. It's foul hooked. Get the net. Never mind. Uh, no, I don't think like yours or. Hooked him in the back. Wait, you lasso him? Oh my gosh, look at that. He's not even hooked. He's lassoed. It looks like a horse with a bridle. 
the line's right through his mouth, see? You're almost you're getting there. You're almost there. You're the leader. One more good one. See it? Uh, coming up. Oh, yeah. It's a good one. There, go. there we go. <laughs> it is a good one. Thank you. Get up. Alright guys, uh, Chris rehooked this one. He's been on a roll. We've hooked a lot of good fish. This is not even the biggest one, um, but it's really great to be able to catch them. Uh, again, it was rough, so we stopped out here. Actually get a lot bigger, but pretty happy to, uh, to get them, you know, have these fish. Good successful snapper season. We got some fish. It's only 9.15. Got the whole day to do uh, some more fishing. All right, guys, we just ran in shore. We heard there was a good bite on the beach. We're just a couple miles offshore of the beach, hoping to get on that good bite. We just got lines out. Still a little windy in shore. I thought it'd be less windy, but it's kicking it. Um, it's kind of out of the southwest, so at least we're kind of shielded. But right now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna troll some live baits, hopefully catch some kingfish, sailfish, Spanish, whatever else is in the area. Hopefully we'll be pretty good. The snapper uh, did good. We went to the ledge, fished a really nice ledge on the Seymour maps, and uh, kind of right on, right, right about on top. I guess we we're kind of on the deep side, but right close to being dead over it. I was watching our our baits were free swimming right there by it. That's a nice fish here. Nice fish here. All right, guys, got a kingfish made a good run. All right, John, first fish on. I seen, it's really cool, I could see some live bait I threw out swimming right there by the downrigger, so it's pretty awesome that it hit the downrigger right then. Ah, oh, dang it, pop, real, 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 real. Yeah. Popped off, that was interesting. So check it out guys. We lost the downrigger. A fish just hit it and popped it. And you can see we just got mono over here. Take a look at this. It looks fine at first, but when you take off tension, it's coiled, it's kinked. And that's like if you've ever made ribbons like for decoration where you run your scissors straight down something and it curls it. That is usually what we see when a kingfish went head on into it and had his mouth open and it took that cable right through his mouth, kinked it up, so he hit it head on. Oh yeah, yeah, look at it. I got that other line. Whoa, it's sky. Wow, we, there you go. Yeah. Uh, loop to the left. You got me. Yeah, that line to my face. Going around. Oh. 
I'll get them nice and steady for them so you have plenty of time. Hard to it's coming up. Nice. There we go, guys. Good gas. Right by the head. All right, guys. Kept losing them, but finally got this one to the boat. He was uh, just hooked along the side of the mountain. Uh, thankfully, we got him in. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video today. It was a lot of fun. Really happy with the team. You know, we had a full boat, and it makes things more difficult, as y'all are probably aware, when you get a lot of people on, um, moving around, walking around, and it was a little rougher. But the team did great. Everyone caught fish. Um, Chris and Sierra had really nice fish. My dad had the biggest fish yesterday. Um, I think Chris got the biggest or Sierra today. So uh, all in all, it was great though. We got all of our fish. You know, hope hope we get more snapper days in the future. The population is really doing well. I really encourage you guys to reach out to your elected officials, FWC, everyone. Try to spread the word. Uh, let them know. I mean, there's a ton of fish out there. It's just insane. But all that aside, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We had a lot of fun. Caught some kingfish and snapper. Got a lot more videos coming. So if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and find us on Instagram and Facebook. See you guys next time.